The game started with a gentleman's dog named Pickle, and Pickle used to come and retrieve his balls for him. So that's how the na name started, Pickleball. We're joined now by Jim Joyner, who is uh, the chairman of the Arlington Pickleball Committee, uh, also known as JJ. Mm -hmm. JJ, uh, JJ thanks in the house. JJ in the house. Jim, thanks for joining us. Uh, you're here to tell us about Pickleball. What is Pickleball? Well, it's a great game with a funny name. <laughs> this is a pickleball. It's a little beefed up wiffle ball. This is a pickleball paddle. Pickleball, according to the Pickleball Association, is the fastest growing sport in the United States. Uh, it's the fastest growing sport for seniors, certainly. So it's kind of like a mixture of tennis and ping pong? Is it's that a, a, a mixture of tennis, badminton. It's played on a badminton court. Okay. So if someone uh, wants to get started, they've never heard of it, but they're interested by watching mm -hmm. today. Like, how do they get involved, whether they're a senior or a kid? Like, what's their options? Arlington is very, very fortunate that the uh, Arlington Parks and Recreation and um, the Office of Senior Adult Programs in particular is very supportive of pickleball. And they've set up two courts at Walter Reed Community Center. And there are two courts of pickleball at uh, Thomas Jefferson Community Center. We also have one of the best pickleball players and instructors in the entire area. His name is Tui Pomsuvan. When he plays, he wins gold medals everywhere he goes, but he is being employed by the Office of Senior Adult Programs to give pickleball lessons. It sounds like right in Arlington, you've got the best possible teacher you could ever have to learn pickleball. Mm -hmm. And the best support from the Arlington uh, Parks and Recreation Committee. Fantastic. Well, J.J., we really appreciate your time today. Thank, Thank you, you very much. Us. Thanks for having me. And a name that he did mention, Helen White. She's actually going to be joining us later in the show to talk to us more about senior fitness.